Hey guys, I'm Dan and welcome to a brand new video and today I'm super excited to be showing you 6 Dr. Steve Hunter's Jurassic eggs, okay? And each egg contains a stretchy dinosaur which I have never seen before. So I'm really looking forward to see how they look like, okay? But before I start, just want to say a huge thank you to you guys for your amazing support. You know, keep those comments coming in. I love hearing from you guys, okay? So let's get started. So let's start off with the Spinosaurus, okay? Let's take a look at this egg, okay? It says Dr. Steve Hunter's in a nice illustration of a dinosaur hatching from an egg. And um, yeah, warning, choking hazard, small parts not for children under 3 years. And you guys can actually check out drstevehunters.com for more information about you know, this toy, okay? So this is actually a stretchable dinosaur that actually seeks to collect, so I'm pretty excited, so let's open this up. So let's just unwrap this to plastic covering and this is actually from Joe Woe okay and let's remove this paper sleeve so we have this really nice looking egg which is slightly translucent looking and there's a nice Joe Woe logo in front so let's open this up. Wow. And what do we have here? A Spinosaurus. And um, there's a cart. There's a cart here. Let's have a look at the cart first. Okay, Spinosaurus. There's a nice illustration of the Spinosaurus versus a human being. Okay, just age 99 to 95 million years ago, Cretaceous period. And um, yeah, it's really cool. There's a nice fact about the Spinosaurus here. Did you know that the enormous sail on his back was used to entrap the heat? So that's pretty cool, okay? And there's some facts about the dinosaur at the back. Let's have a look at the stretchy dinosaur. Let's see how stretchy this is, okay? So this is a pretty cool dinosaur which is I guess it's very suitable for like children and kids. So let's see. <laughs> okay. So this is pretty funny, okay. And you can actually fuse there like like bubbles or you know like uh, some particles inside the spinosaurus which is really fun to press. And you can actually stretch the arms. Which is really funny, okay. It's a li little bit slimy looking. And take a look at the mouth, you can really stretch the mouth, okay? Yeah, so this is a cute Spinosaurus, okay? Just place this over here, and wow, it can really stand, okay? And the next one we are going to open is the Stegosaurus, okay? I'll need to make an opening with a scissors right over here. If you're using scissors at home, please have your um, parents to supervise you, okay? So you guys must be wondering where you can purchase this um, surprise eggs. I guess you can go to Amazon.com and search for Joe World Jurassic Eggs, okay? Maybe you can put in like Dr. Steve Hunters as well. So this one is the Stegosaurus. Let's open this up. <laughs> wow, this is in red, okay, which is really nice. Let's have a look at the card first. Stegosaurus is a pretty huge dinosaur, okay. Let us read. Did you know that Stegosaurus used the plates running along its back to entrap the heat? Okay, so this is pretty much similar to um the function of the sail of the Spinosaurus. What do we have here? A Stegosaurus. This is a stretchy st Stegosaurus and let, let us see how long we can stretch this. Wow, it's really, really long, okay? And I haven't even stretched the body yet. Wow, 
this is pretty cool as you can see they're actually like um what do you call this like foam really cool balls inside styrofoam balls really cute so a stegosaurus you can see this is not really a detailed you know toy of a stegosaurus it's made it's purely just you know um for fun okay as you can see there are only um four spikes over here yeah just place this over here and next I'm gonna open the Velociraptor gonna make a small cut here it's not easy to cut this okay Let's open this up now. <laughs> Let's have a look at the card first, okay? So this is a Velociraptor. And it says, did you know that Velociraptor had his hind feet a claw similar to a flick knife, okay? It's referring to this claw over here, okay? So what do we have here? A yellow Velociraptor with some um, purple stripes. And um, this Velociraptor actually looks pretty much like the T-Rex, you know, I feel. Except for, um, you know, this sickle claw. And let us see how long we can stretch this Velociraptor. Wow, this is really long. <laughs> and let let us check out styrofoam balls in its body okay we can't really see this clearly as compared to the stegosaurus but as you can hear when you're pressing against it there's some really nice um, noise <laughs> okay you can really stretch the head as well okay the legs and the tail too so they look really colorful and they look really fun to play with perhaps you know kids can play them in the bath not too sure next we can open this up the triceratops gonna make an opening around here By the way, I will be making um, like a Tomi Takara video tomorrow, so stay tuned for that. I actually bought a new cool dinosaur playset, okay? It's really awesome. So this is a Triceratops. And let us have a look at the card inside. Did you know that the Triceratops could run up to 21.7 miles per hour? That is pretty fast, okay? For a huge um, dinosaur like Triceratops. So this is a Triceratops. This is pretty um, firm as compared to the rest. And let us see how long we can stretch this, okay? There's actually um, some text below it says triceratops and filling EPS beads okay so I guess those are EPS bits and let us see how long we can stretch this triceratops pretty long as well but not as long as the, the stegosaurus and um, the velociraptor and the body of this is actually are much stiffer as compared to the rest 
and it kind of, you know, it has a very sticky feeling, <laughs> which is really uh, fun. You can even, you know, pull the horns really, really long, okay. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Let's have a look at the Apatosaurus, okay. We basically have like, um, one more left. Okay, cutting an opening here so that we can tear off this plastic film out easily. Okay. I feel this, you know, this egg cover is really cool. You can use them for a lot of my toys. And um, yeah, we have the Apatosaurus. The Apatosaurus actually looks pretty good as compared to the rest. So did you know that its whip tail was composed by 80 bones? And that is quite a number of bones, okay? So let's have a look at the Apatosaurus and let us see how long we can stretch this toy, okay? Wow, this is definitely the longest of all. All super long. This is like super long. And let us see whether we can see the beats. Okay, we can actually see the EPS beats, the styrofoam balls, which is really cute. Wow. I feel this Apatosaurus is actually the nicer looking one um, as compared to the rest. You know, at least the heat doesn't look so comical as compared to the rest okay and the next one the last one we are gonna open will be um, the Tyrannosaurus Rex okay so this is actually a video which is pretty different to my usual videos you know because I saw this you know I saw all these eggs and toys R us and I thought you know I could just purchase them and make a video for you guys to watch yeah, so I hope you guys do enjoy it. You know, definitely this toys are not for collectors, but mo mostly for like, kids, for fun. You know, pretty fun to play with, I guess. I'm having a little trouble cutting this. Okay. I almost gave myself a cut. <laughs> Okay, so we are looking at the last Jurassic egg and um, this is the T-Rex. The T-Rex is in green as well, which is pretty similar to um, the Spinosaurus and um, yeah, let, let us read some facts about the T-Rex. Did you know that the Tyrannosaurus Rex is the biggest carnivore ever existed? I'm not too sure about that because the Spinosaurus is actually bigger than um, the Tyrannosaurus Rex and um, if you consider Mosasaurus a dinosaur and Mosasaurus is actually way bigger than, than a T-Rex so I'm not too sure about this fact okay you know do let me know what you guys think so we have a T-Rex over here okay fair enough the head it looks like a T-Rex head and um, yeah, the two arms, the two tiny arms. And let us see how long we can stretch this cute little fella over here. Okay, pretty long as well. Okay. So we have all six dinosaurs here. They're really colorful dinosaurs. Okay, so let me know what you guys think of this um, dinosaur toys from Joe you know, Joe World, they are pretty good at producing, you know, those kind of fossilized dinosaur toys, you know, some really cool figures. And this is actually the first time I'm actually purchasing, like, you know, kids toys from Joe World. I feel they are, you know, decent, you know, you, you can't compare them to, you know, like Papo and stuff. It's a refreshing change, 
you know I love the egg shells yeah so let me know what you guys think of the toys okay so I hope you guys enjoyed the video so we have the Spinosaurus, Dagosaurus, um, Velociraptor, Triceratops, a Pedosaurus and the Tyrannosaurus Rex okay so that's all for today's video I hope you guys enjoy it and if you do do give it a thumbs up you know share it leave me a comment I read every single one of them and I'll see you tomorrow in the next video see ya Um, this is basically an Indominus Rex, which is like, I'm not too sure, is this like a level 40 Indominus Rex? I think so. So if you press this button on, you know, on the side of the body, something will happen and take a look at this. So five yellow spikes, you know, springs right out from the center of the body, as you can see. There are like two rows of um, red spikes and one row of yellow spikes right in the middle. And uh, yeah, and for um, to retract the yellow spikes, you can actually press the button again. And it produces a loud roar, okay. And what is fun about this toy is that it produces different roars when you press the arm downwards. And the head will actually move. But there are a couple of um, different actions. So here we go.